What's up, guys? Welcome back to another episode of the Boozing and Betting Podcast, Mixed Up. I'm your host, Tyler. Today, you know, we're doing a little bit of TV, TV style. You know, everybody watches TV. In particular, Blue Mountain State, Thad Castle. We all know Thad. One of the best TV shows, you know, sports TV shows out there, especially if you were in a fraternity, you definitely watch this. You know, I hope none of you followed their footsteps, but I know some of you have. If you have, leave it in the comments. It's your craziest Blue Mountain State type story. How many couches have you set on fire? That kind of stuff. But we're talking about Thad Castle today. His favorite drink is the Mojito. That is why I have this glorious stuff in front of you. Everybody loves rum. If you don't, too bad. More for the rest of us. So let's get in today. It's a pretty easy drink. All you're gonna need is some mint, some sugar cube, or white ground sugar, I guess. Some fresh squeezed lime juice. Bottle of, well, your choice of silver rum. If you wanna get crazy, do dark rum, but I'm gonna show you how to make it today. There are many different ways to make it, but the way that I make it is first, I take a sugar cube imported from France. I'll toss that in my shaker. And if I can get my assistant to hand me a jigger, thank you. You're gonna need a jigger. You're gonna do one ounce of lime juice on top of the sugar cube. Just like so, put your jigger off to the side. Then you're gonna take a muddler. Some people call it a salt muddler, grinder, the one that does not have teeth. You're gonna get that sugar cube nice and soaked. Take your muddler in the fist, thumb on top. You're gonna give it a nice little bang. You wanna get it as ground up as possible. That's why some people like to use brown sugar already. And out of our sprig of mint, we're gonna take one piece, slap it, one piece, slap it, not throw it in the floor, put it in your shaker, take your rum, your choice of rum, I chose Bacardi. We're gonna do an ounce and a half, right on in there, perfect. And we're gonna take some crushed ice. You know they always say, if you're not making a mess when you're bartending, you're doing it wrong. Take it, put your shaker together, give it to the old. If you don't make the face, you're not doing it right. You gotta get the beat going. You're gonna shake it till it hurts. Give it a nice slap over there. You're gonna take your glass. Notice I picked up the ice. Don't do that. You're gonna take the rest of your mint, give it a nice slap, and you're gonna throw it in the bottom. And then you're gonna guide your ice in there all the way to the top. A Hawthorne strainer. Move that out of the way. You're gonna fill that bad boy up. If you did it right, it should stop about three-fourths. Soda water's next. I prefer Q soda water because I'm bougie like that. Shit's expensive. Throw her nice and... Then you're gonna grab a lime wheel. Slide that baby on the side. Take your straw. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is the mojito. can see why Thad likes these. That's real cold. But it was pretty good. I'm gonna start a new thing. I'm gonna rate these drinks. 
Crushable, nine out of 10. Taste, 7.8 out of 10. Thank you, Thad. We'll see you next week on Mixed Up with the Boozing and Betting Podcast. Peace out, guys. <laughs>